Welcome everyone! ProShow Web now supports unbranded sharing for premium users. This means your links will no longer include any ProShow related information and the player page that loads will be blank without any ProShow Web logos. This allows you to share a link with your clients without acknowledging your show was created using ProShow Web. Let's get started with how to share an unbranded link to your show. It's really easy. Start by selecting a show you've created in ProShow Web under the Shows tab, and then click on Watch. Once the page loads, click on the Share option beneath the preview window. Premium users have two options for branding, ProShow and Custom. For unbranded links, select Custom and then choose your destination. Let's start by clicking on the Link option. You'll notice that you have the same two choices, ProShow and Custom. See how the URL changes as you toggle between the two. Both will take you to a page to watch the show, but Custom takes you to an unbranded page, while ProShow takes you to the ProShow website, which you may not want your clients to know about. So let's copy and paste the Custom link into a new web page to see what happens. As you can see, the show loads on a blank page where your show will simply play. Even if the viewer tries to see what was used to create the show by going to showvid.com, it'll just take them to a blank page. In addition to the link option, unbranded links also works for Facebook and Twitter. Just remember to choose the custom option first and then choose the appropriate icon. YouTube and sharing do not support unbranded links because the video is loaded directly into a different website that has its own rules for governing how it's branded. And the embedding feature simply is irrelevant for branding. So remember, if you want to use unbranded links, choose Link, Facebook, or Twitter. Now that you have your options for unbranded links, let's take a look at how to customize your show page. Here we have the default page which is simply blank with a black background. To start customizing, you'll need to go back to ProShow Web and then at the top of your screen, hover your mouse over your account name and select your account. Then click on Change ProShow Web Settings and Options. Once this page loads, scroll on down to the unbranded sections. Here's where you'll be able to customize the page. First of all, you can include a website link to the player page by typing it into the URL box. This is a great way to direct your viewers to your personal site or anywhere you like. You can also customize the display of the link by typing into the link text. Let's set this up as a wedding show. We'll assume that you'll want to show this to clients, so let's link it to redcart.com. And we'll also put in the link text, Purchase Prints Online. This will create a link in the top right of your page, which will send your clients directly to your Redcart site where they can order prints. After you've made a change, remember to hit Apply, and then refresh your page to see the updated look. And as you can see, all of the new changes have been implemented. Moving on, you can also customize the colors of your page. To do so, scroll down to the Unbranded Watch Page Color section. The fields contain hexadecimal color values that set the color scheme of your page. Using these hexadecimal values to set color is a standard practice in web development. For more information, as well as a full listing of color codes, just type in hexadecimal color values into your favorite search engine. To show you how it works, let's change the background color together. The code for white is 6 Fs, so notice what happens as we type in 6 Fs into the background color and then click out of the box. You'll notice that any changes will be updated. To save time, I've already customized the rest by entering the appropriate color values. So now, I can hit Apply, and then refresh my page to see the changes. Note how the tone of the page has completely changed with the new colors. You also have the option to use an image from your computer as your background. To do this, scroll all the way down to the bottom under Unbranded Watch Page Background Image, and choose to upload a new background image. Here, just hit Browse, and then select an image from your computer. Then, you can choose if you want to tile it or not to tile it. I'm going to choose not to tile it, and then I'm going to apply. And then once again, refresh your page, and you'll now see that the background that we've selected is now the image from our computer. And you should now have everything you need to not only share your unbranded shows, but also customize your page the way you like. 
If you need further information, please visit web.photodex.com help branding.